is this week HCC was selected by the Connecticut Board of Regents for Higher Education as one of three community colleges to, de to develop and expand a manufacturing center. And these centers are to provide the courses, programs needed by current and future employer employers in Southwest Connecticut. Hi, this is State Representative Tony Huang. I'm here at Housatonic Community College to interview some of the major proponents of this grant that we've gotten from the Board of Regents. We have President Galenicki, who will describe a little bit of what the program is about. What the program is about is to add to the college an advanced manufacturing center. And this will have a manufacturing lab as well as an engineering and design lab. And the easiest way to describe it, to take our students higher and further and to be ready for those good paying manufacturing jobs. And we have the Dean of uh, Academic Affairs, um, uh, Elizabeth Koop and love to have her speak a couple words as well. Well, I was able to speak to people this afternoon and say how exciting it is that as an academic dean to have a major new facility that will bring us to the forefront of manufacturing and advanced precision fact manufacturing for both credit and non-credit programs. And we're excited to get starting at a new level, started at a new level. And we have Senator Edwin Gromes, uh, who represents Bridgeport and has done so, so well and has been a major advocate and supporter of Housatonic. Loved for him to be able to offer his viewpoints on this. Well, it's not too hard to be a major um, supporter of Housatonic College when you look at what they've done in the, in the years that they've been here. I look at this thing about this manufacturing lab thing as being something that um, will benefit uh, some of the youth and the people who are looking to advance themselves in, and, and uh, the education of manufacturing. Being a person who is um, in the past being a, a representative of um, labor in this area, I had some of the plants that did go out of this city and I would welcome them to see that manufacturing come back to the city of Bridgeport. The winners in this grant are our community, education of our workforce, and our businesses and creating jobs. It is an information age, and that's where this community college is going in partnership, very excitingly, with Platt and Emmett O'Brien and with other technical schools because it is a continuum. And Tony, Tony Wang, ever since he come up there, he's been a He's been a hell of a person for supporting Bridgeport and anything around it. He, he's always in the forefront. In fact, he put me in the forefront of this thing. It was him that led me. I thank you very much.